Democratic presidential nominee Kamala Harris and her running mate, Minnesota Governor Tim Walz, are in Phoenix tonight. As the two hold a rally in seven battleground states across the country. After touching down at Sky Harbor tonight, the vice president's motorcade, they headed over to the Sheraton in downtown Phoenix. The pair are preparing for a big event, event tomorrow in Glendale. And Fox 10's Nicole Christine was on the tarmac tonight when they arrived. She spoke with several Arizona leaders about Harris's visit to Arizona. Nicole. Yeah, good evening, John and Christina. The vice president landed around 6.30 this evening. She was met with this monsoon weather that we were just talking about earlier in the show. And then Governor Walls arrived around 45 minutes later in a separate charter flight. Now, this is Harris's second visit to the Valley this summer. She came in June on the anniversary of the overturning of Roe v. Wade to talk about reproductive rights. But at tomorrow's rally, there will be a slew of topics discussed as we now sit less than 90 days away from Election Day. I think that Kamala Harris matches Arizona perfectly. Thursday night, a small group of big political players in the Grand Canyon State greeted Vice President and Democratic presidential nominee Kamala Harris at Sky Harbor International Airport. She didn't address reporters, but her supporters said they wouldn't miss the chance to welcome her to Arizona. I've known the Vice President for over 20 years. We were uh, in a leadership development program together. I really respect her, so why wouldn't I be here? Of course. She's a very inspirational person. I've got a, a, a wonderful background story and very impressed. I, I was today uh, very impressed just by how personable she was, how charming she was. Attorney General Chris Mays brought her daughter Hattie to witness Harris's arrival. My daughter doesn't like to go to very many political events, but she wanted to come to this one because it's we, we just witnessed the first female president of the United States. That's what I think we have in Kamala Harris. And I also think this is it's a role model for all all girls and women in this country. As for Friday's rally, Democrats say the contrast between former President Donald Trump and Harris will be made clear for Arizona voters. You see a very, very different style, very different uh, uh, pr priorities for the vice president. I think the American people are going to realize that uh, this vice president is a strong candidate for president of the United States. The difference in, between Donald Trump and Kamala Harris is the difference between uh, chaos and sanity and uh, incredible competency as well. Now, here's the rundown for tomorrow's rally. It's set to begin. Doors will open, rather, at 1.30 at Desert Diamond Arena in Glendale. Now, you're asked if you're going to attend to be there no later than 3.30 p.m. And it's important to note that anyone who has RSVP'd already might be in, invited in. But if you have an RSVP'd already, they are confirming that at the door. We will be there covering the rally tomorrow. But for now, reporting from Sky Harbor International Airport, Nicole Christine, Fox 10 News.